We're going to explain how to enable UFI mode in your ASRock BIOS. This process might vary slightly depending on your exact ASRock motherboard model and BIOS version, but the general steps are similar. Remember to save your BIOS settings before exiting. First, you need to access your BIOS. This usually involves restarting your computer and repeatedly pressing a specific key during startup, often delete F2 or F12. The exact key is usually displayed briefly on the screen during the boot process. Two, once in the BIOS, you'll be presented with a menu system. Navigate this using your arrow keys. The specific menu names might differ, but look for options related to boot, boot options, CSM, launch CSM, or UEFI boot. Three, Locate the setting that controls Compatibility Support Module, CSM, or Legacy Boot. This setting manages whether your system uses Legacy BIOS, MBR, or UFI, GPT booting. Four, the CSM setting needs to be disabled to enable UEFI booting exclusively. If you see an option explicitly named UEFI boot, enable it. Some BIOSes simply have a switch to enable or disable CSM. Disabling CSM is usually equivalent to enabling UEFI. 5. If your BIOS has separate settings for UEFI boot and legacy boot, make sure UEFI boot is enabled and legacy boot is disabled. Double check to ensure that only UEFI is selected. 6. After changing these settings, you'll typically find a save and exit option. This is usually found under a menu labeled exit or something similar. Use this option to save your changes and restart the computer. 7. Your computer will now boot using UEFI. If you encounter any issues after changing these settings, it's always a good idea to re-enter the BIOS and revert the changes. This will reset your boot mode back to the previous setting. Finally, remember that you may need to create a UEFI compatible installation media, like a USB drive, for installing an operating system if you're switching from legacy boot to UEFI. Always consult your motherboard's manual for specific instructions related to your model. Different ASRock motherboards might have slightly different BIOS layouts and terminology.